What is up guys and welcome back to another episode. Well today guys we were back out here at the spillway. I haven't been back out here in about feels like a week, maybe two. I don't know, it's been a while. But we recently had some good rain, the water levels come up a little bit. So I'm back out here trying to catch some good bass for y'all. Um, the first thing I'm gonna start out with is right here. This little uh pretty sure it's an eagle claw uh, spinnerbait, gold, chartreuse and white uh, hair jig. And I'm throwing it on the Abbe Garcia Revo S. And I'm throwing it on the Abbe Garcia uh, Vendetta rod. It's a 6.6 uh, medium heavy rod. But it's looking really good. I've seen a lot of blow ups already. I've seen a bunch of fish coming up eating. So it's looking good for us today. It's looking really, really good. So hopefully we can catch some for y'all and it'll be a good day. There's a guy. Yeah. He's fighting. He's a fighter. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh, no, no, no. He spit it. No. Oh. That was my fault. So... That was my fault. I uh, right at the last minute, I kind of let the pressure off of the line, and uh, he jumped and spit it. I should have kept my rod down and tried to kept him down, but you know what? At least we know they're in here and they're biting. So let's throw it back out there and try again. So I'm about to rig up this classic runner, road runner, swim bait, because I really want to try this guy out. Get him out of the package here. I mean, look at that thing. That is like super swim bait finesse with the bladed jig. That is just gonna do it. I'm gonna put it on this Revo X reel. Okay, so I put on another bait. We're gonna go with the Roadrunner spinner bait, this little finesse type jig, because this thing just looks super sick, super saucy. I'm gonna throw this out here and see if they go for it. I mean, I already have one almost catch, almost, on the spinner bait, so hopefully they're going for flashy stuff. So I'm gonna throw this on and See what we can get. There we go. Put this bad boy on. Get. Oh. Something pecking at it. So no luck on the swim bait. So now I'm gonna put on this little flunker hunt crankbait. So we have any better luck with this. Okay, so we didn't have any luck with the swim bait unfortunately, even though it looked really, really good in the water. So the next bait I'm putting on is this uh the lunker hunt impact. If I can get the focus, there it is. Yeah, so this is the lunker hunt impact. It dives 2.5 feet, which is perfect for this really shallow water right here. So hopefully the fish will bite this since they weren't biting that swim bait. Got one. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh my god. Oh, he speared it. That was a monster too. Crap. Dang it. Oh, guys, did y'all see that thing jump? That was freaking insane. God, that was every bit of a good three pound. That sucker was fat. That might have been the biggest fish that's actually in this pool. But that was all on me, man. I, 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 I've been uh, snagged right there before because there's like a fallen tree right there, and I thought that's what it was. So when I snagged it, 
I kind of just stopped reeling because I just want to let that, you know, crankbait come up and get off the, the log. But no, man, that thing started taking off and I pulled and that sucker jumped straight out of the water. Huge fish and spit it. That was all on me. That was all on me. If I would have known there was a fish, I could have set that hook way better than what I did. And I definitely would have had that. But dang, so that's two nice fish I've lost so far. Dang it, dang it, dang it. It's going to bother me for the rest of the day. Ah! Well, guys, that was a very unfortunate day of fishing on my part. I hooked up with two really good fish and somehow managed to lose both of them, which really sucks. I'm really going to be salty about that for the rest of the day. But anyway, guys, there's something I've been wanting to do, and I haven't done it in a while. I haven't done it since I believe I had 400 subscribers, and that is do a giveaway for all you awesome people that like, watch, and support my channel. Now, the giveaway I'm going to be doing is going to be a mystery tackle box, but not just one month mystery tackle box. It's going to be a mixture of two months. It's going to be the May mystery tackle box and this April mystery tackle box box all put together so everything that's going to be in this mystery tackle box let me open it up for you is i'm going to have the bagley spinner shad uh, i'm going to throw in some uh, guggenbait trench hogs some kvd perfect plastic uh rodent and green pumpkin uh the strike pro topwater jerk bait the z-man bladed football jig some uh more z-man ned rig trailers uh, the Castic Loco 10 White Crankbait. The Excite uh, Raptor Tail Jr. also in Green Pumpkin. And some Harmony 3 aught hooks. So all this stuff is going to be in, if I can get it shut, is going to be in this mystery tackle box all together. The three ways you uh, enter to win is you got to make sure you subscribe to my channel. So if you're not subscribed already, please make sure you hit the subscribe button so you can enter the awesome giveaway. You got to make sure to leave a comment in the comments below. Anything you want, you can tag someone or do hashtag 700 subs. And you got to make sure to like this video. So you have to do all three of those things to enter this giveaway. And I will be announcing the winner of the giveaway in a week's time. So make sure to subscribe, make sure to like, make sure to drop the comments to enter this awesome giveaway, guys. Because I don't do these very often. I'm going to try to do a little more often for y'all but yeah i really hope y'all enjoyed the video i love all y'all y'all are amazing y'all push me to want to do more and more videos for y'all so if you haven't already guys please make sure to like and subscribe to the dark relaxing channel make sure the notification bell for awesome videos like this make sure you give this video the big thumbs up i love you guys and y'all keep it real